A small service was held outside the Hidalgo County Courthouse this morning supporting victims of domestic violence. CBS 4's Imelda Mejia has all the details about the event. According to the Texas Council on Family Violence, more than 100 women lose their lives in domestic violence murders each year. These markers are placed here to remember those victims and keep more from dying at the hands of abuse. In 2015, Mujeres Unidas, a support center and shelter for victims of domestic violence and survivors of sexual assault and their families, helped 3,000 women out of those 226 females and 350 children stayed at the shelter for safety. But those numbers don't represent everyone. That's why county leaders gathered Tuesday morning asking others to come forward. I know it's difficult. We've heard many, many stories in our offices about individuals who are afraid to come out. And sometimes it's too late. Please, I ask you, and, I, and, I'm, and, I, and I'm showing you that all these individuals that are here today are here for you. Dressed in purple, officers, civilians, and students stood in solidarity for those abused by the hands of a loved one. Domestic violence comes in all forms, including emotional, physical, and mental. Hidalgo County leaders told the public help is available, but they can only step in if they speak up. As a defense attorney, I see it all the time. One of the biggest problems that we have is that women drop the charges. Women drop the charges. So one of the things that we've got to say is y'all need to be strong. We encourage you to take part in the conversation like you're doing today. A candlelight vigil will be held by Mujeres Unidas later in the month of October, but leaders say the best thing to do is report domestic violence when you see it to keep other victims from dying. In Hidalgo County, email de Mejia, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. Hidalgo County Sheriff Eddie Guerra says commissioner's court just approved his request to hire three more officers. They will be part of the domestic violence task force. 